Ecuadorian pride could be felt throughout the rotunda here at the Bronx County Building for the Bronx Borough President's annual celebration that takes place during Hispanic Heritage Month. Thank you. We are very happy, you know, being born and raised in New York. I'm a Brooklyn girl, but today I'm a Bronx girl. <laughs> I'm a Yankee girl, that's the most important thing though. <laughs> Her parents are from Ecuador, 93.1 Amor Radio DJ Gloria B was among the four honorees recognized for their work in promoting Ecuadorian culture while enhancing the lives of all New Yorkers. The Honorable Supreme Court Judge Carmen Velasquez is another. She shared that as someone who talks with high school students regularly about her struggle to become a lawyer, she wants all of them to know they too can achieve their dreams take my time to go and tell people that no matter what happens, no matter what people tell you, that you can, so long as you work hard, you go to school, you can do this. I mean, uh, people told me I couldn't be a judge, I couldn't be a lawyer, I couldn't graduate from high school, I couldn't graduate from college, but here we are, Supreme Court judge. And co-hosting the evening, president and co-founder of the New York Hispanic Cosmetology and Beauty Chamber of Commerce and executive producer of Abrendo Brecha International, Charito Cisneros, who's been credited for assisting small businesses comply with ever-changing regulations. I feel so happy because people that contribute, especially in the Bronx, so this is for me, it's really a pleasure and really happy to be the, all my people are right here. Her work has gained her recognition, both with international leaders and those here in the Bronx. Charito Cisnero is someone who has not only provided for herself as an entrepreneur, provided for her family, but has really done the, 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 gra the grassroots work in organizing. Joining Cisneros is her daughter, Romy Pinella, a director who identified the need to train small businesses on how to operate effectively. It went from People who didn't understood that this even license application exists, understanding the regulation, understanding this workshop, how to operate a beauty salon or you know a fashion industry, to like, having more knowledge about it and understanding that now they're speaking out. Wait, we need something like this over here. We need so it's great. We have a bigger beauty community now. Also honored dentist Dr. Hector Barnaby. You can see many colors here tonight on this Hispanic Heritage Month celebration. But as for tonight, there's only one combination that counts. Viva Ecuador. For Ronsnap, this is Arlene Makoko.